Buying a home in the Asheville area is getting more expensive. In fact, the average price is topping all other North Carolina cities from Charlotte to Raleigh. The average ask price for a Buncombe County home right now is now $536,000. News 13's Kimberly King is live on the north side in Grove Park. And is this market pricing home buyers out of the market? Frank, it absolutely is. This home behind me here in the Grove Park area sold last month for $352,000, and it's a fixer upper. Brokers tell me they haven't seen a market like this since 2005. All over Buncombe County for sale signs are up, and the market hasn't even hit peak season. Don Davies, who runs real estate analysis firm Real Search, says prices are at an all-time high, with an average ask price over half a million dollars. Town is crazy as far as real estate goes. Artist Elise Okren moved to Asheville with her husband to thrive in the creative scene. Um, we're looking for something in the about 350 area. If you don't put a bid on it within an hour. It's gone. Asheville's prices are now higher than every other major city in North Carolina. I came from the Raleigh Durham area, and you got a lot more house for your money there. It almost feels like 2005, 2006, and we're actually seeing competing offers. Broker Janet Whitworth says prices are up by over 13% from last year. Our topography here doesn't lend for a lot of sprawl, and so people want to be in town. And there's just a, a finite amount of land in town on which to build. This is the Chateau Heathcliff. It's 2,328 square feet, all on one level. On the north side, Alex Britton with the Toms Estate is selling what's marketed as lock and leave homes requiring little or no maintenance. The price for this one? Uh, 555000 we actually had no slowdown in January, February, which, as my sales people tell you, is just unheard of here in Asheville. The Toms Estate developer broke ground on these homes around a horseshoe in March of 2014. Of the 40 home sites, 25 have already been sold, all of them going for over half a million dollars. We have a lot of people who are cash buyers also, and I think a lot of it has to do, if you go below this, it's hard to get the financing. But for buyers like artist Elise, they're left to vie for more affordable spots that right now in Asheville are few and far between. The broker that we spoke to told us that there was very low inventory over the winter time, and that has contributed to the tight market currently. Also, brokers say there are just not a lot of homes being built in the $300,000 to $400,000 range around the Asheville area. Reporting live in Grove Park, Kimberly King, News 13.